to another video and another morning routine video, okay? We're doing another one, but this is not like other morning routines, okay? This is different because this is morning routine with the puppy. Oh my goodness, please do not lick the camera. Oh my, oh my gosh. Oh my. Um. So I just woke up. We've been sleeping down here on the couches. Ow, ow. Um. Andre's there on his side because we need to be um, close to him, obviously. And also we wanna be close to like being able to let him out. So we can let him out here just on the grass there. Whereas if we were sleeping in the bedroom, we would have to like carry him down the stairs in the middle of the night. And we just thought it was easier to sleep on the couch down here for the first bit. So this is, this is the new, this is the new bed. It's been the couch. It's been a little, a little hard. Yeah, it's been a little, um, a little rough. Mm -hmm. It's not as comfortable, but um, it's, it's been working out for him. So yeah, I just woke up. I'm gonna show you guys where he's been sleeping too. You wanna show everybody your bed? So I mentioned in the last video that he was in the crate, but he didn't like it. Like he wasn't a fan of the crate. Um, so we actually took the door off. I know you are very happy about that. And he has been sleeping in this pen instead. So he has the whole pen now, not just the crate. Um, so he usually sleeps on that bed but he has way more space and he has been liking it a million times better. Worried um, that he was gonna have a bunch of accidents and stuff because that's why you do the crate. I mean, obviously you want them to love the crate anyways, um, but it helps prevent accidents in the, the middle of the night because they don't wanna you know, go to the bathroom where they sleep and in the crate they don't have enough space to like have a bathroom area and a sleep area. Whereas the pen, he has way more space. So we were like, uh-oh, is he gonna have accidents? He does not, he's amazing. He, I, I do have to wake up in the middle of the night, so I woke up, you know, at 5 a.m. is 5, 21 in the morning. Okay, come on, I know it's raining, you don't wanna go pee, but you, you kinda have to. Go pee, yes. Hey, good boy. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so wet. <laughs> okay, we gotta sleep a little bit more. Still a little too early to get up. Oh my gosh, it's all wet. <laughs> okay, 5.30, I am going to go back to sleep on the couch for a little bit. Um, so took him pee there. So he does have like one to two peas in the middle of the night right now. I'm not setting an alarm anymore because he just lets me know he whines and that means he wants to go out. So I don't really need to set an alarm. He is the alarm and he's doing a great job at being the alarm. Um, so yeah, the sleep's been a little interrupted, but he's been great in the pen. It's a lot better than the crate. He's not really crying at all. He whines for like a minute or two when we put him in, but he likes it way better, so. Killing it. So in the morning, I like to take him out again, which he's not wanting to go under grass right now. He just wants to, just to hang out, yeah. Also, guys, how much bigger has he gotten? Like, okay, try to sit. Sit. <laughs> I don't have a treat. Sit. There we go, good boy. Look at him. Look at him, you're such a good boy. Oh my gosh, he's in a very biting stage right now. He's teething, so he wants to bite everything, including my hands, um, but yeah. Let me know if you think he's gotten bigger. I think he's definitely growing. You think so? Yeah, you're getting into a big boy. So first thing we need to get for him is some water because I pick it up at night. There's no water in the pen just because if he was drinking water all night, he would be peeing constantly. Um, so I pick it up right before I fall asleep. And then once I wake up, we give him his water back. Let us deliver him some water. Are you a thirsty boy? There you go. He loves water. Like he drinks so much. I have to fill it up so many times during the day. Okay, you're not very thirsty right now. It's good. Also, this is the couch monster. What? Yeah, that's the couch monster over there. You have to stay away from him. He's scary and he just plays Clash Royale. What? <laughs> Are you tired? No. <laughs> now, I gotta get him his breakfast, which is also very important. Where are you going? Are you getting a beaver? Oh my gosh, look at this beaver, guys. He loves this beaver. Listen to the noise it makes. <laughs> you want your BB? You want your BB? Oh my gosh. Oh, wait, did you? 
Chew, uh oh, I think there's a hole in Mr. BB. Okay, go get Mr. BB, go get him. <laughs> All right, well, he's gonna tear up Mr. BB. I am going to get him some food. So I got a bunch of different kibble options um, because he actually doesn't really like. Um, so I got one kibble initially, not a big fan. I got these other kibbles, which are these ones, and I got two flavors. I got a chicken flavor and a lamb one. Um, and what I do is I just mix both because I don't know, I feel like he likes the variety, he appreciates it. And then because like, you know, I want him to eat a ton, I take one of these puppy treats and I crunch it up in my fingers and sprinkle it on top and that kind of makes him eat way more. Yeah, because otherwise you weren't really eating all of your kibbies, but now he is eating all of his kibbies. So it's just amazing. <laughs> You're so excited. You're so excited. <laughs> okay, so we have a measuring cup here. And for his like weight and everything, he's supposed to have anywhere from half a cup to a full cup. So I give him the full cup because, you know, I want him to have all of the foods. So this is the kibbies. You are you hungry? Yes, you're such a good boy. Look at you waiting. Oh my gosh, the best boy. So this is the kibble, and then I'm just, I'm gonna need two hands to do this, but I'm just gonna crunch up one of these and sprinkle it on top. Oh, you excited? <laughs> Look at that, good sit. You're so well behaved. Yeah, okay, well now we're just fighting me. Okay, we have the kibbies. You can see the little crumpled up treats on top. So I'm gonna put this in his pen as well. I've been feeding him in his pen because I want him to like, you know, this is like a great place. We love it in here, don't we? And only good things happen in here, like food. Oh, come on, you're not hungry? I know you're hungry. There we go. So he is gonna eat his brekkie. I might try and go make brekkie for myself while he's eating. Do we think that I can do that? I don't know, we can try. His ears always go in his food dish too. <laughs> They're so long and floppy. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh. Okay, we're getting a real nice basic breakfast going here. We have the avocado toast and the little eggies on top. Okay, so I'm gonna eat my breakfast and Charlie is gonna keep me company. I think he's eating a leaf that he brought in from outside. <laughs> what do you got there? What do you got? What is it, huh? Oh, wait, what the heck? Oh my gosh. Okay, we're putting that on the table. Beautiful, thank you. That was, that was amazing. <laughs> I just finished my breakfast and I'm gonna play with him for a little bit to tire him out. So we're gonna play fetch. Are you ready? Sit. Go get it. <laughs> okay, really bounce back. You didn't really have to do much. He doesn't totally understand fetch yet. Like he, he kind of gets it and then doesn't give it to me. So I have to take it from him. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. All right. Oh, you want your bone. Okay, come on, go sit. Sit. Oh no. Oh no. You've got it now. Look at you. Oh my gosh, look at his little face. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Sit. Go get it. Get it. Bring it back. Come in. Bring it back. Yeah. We're getting better. We're getting, I got a little distracted with Mr. Beaver, but you know, this is all improvements. I'm gonna throw a ball to my other puppy. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Go get it. Wait, did you headbutt it? <laughs> so, I give up. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Oh, you got it, okay, good stuff. So I still haven't like really gotten ready for the day yet, but I need to play with him. When he's in a playful mood, I try and like run him around as much as possible so that he will have a nice nap. And then when he naps, I will actually be able to do things. Um, the house is falling apart and <laughs> I need to <laughs> do a million things on this nap. So are we gonna have a good nap? Are we gonna have a good naps? Yeah, we're gonna try, aren't we? Also, if you guys haven't yet, you need to follow him on Instagram because I've been posting a photo of him every single day on Instagram. Every single day, every single day. That's so much more than I post. Um, so his Instagram is Bark Bark Charlie. Go follow him. I'm really interested to see, like, since I'm trying to take a picture every single day, 
I want to see like you know the progress of him growing and we're gonna be able to see like how much he grows every day like how much he grows weekly because I think he's definitely I mean he just looks older like even his face looks more mature from like a week ago which is crazy but this bone is your favorite isn't it yeah it's some tug of war too very important yeah oh my gosh oh my gosh you're so strong oh Eh, eh, eh. Oh, you got it! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Pull it! Pull it! Oh, you got it! You're so good. <laughs> well, we did some running around. He really just wants to chew on his bone right now. But I'm thinking I might do a little, little training session and show you guys what he knows. Oh, gotta keep an eye on you. Oh yeah. Also, he really likes to chew that table. I'm trying to teach him not to, but you know, one thing at a time. <laughs> Some little treats here. Um, <laughs> he's in a bit of a crazy mood right now. He's doing a bunch of zoomies. Um, so I'm going to try, let's see, if he gives me his attention, I'll try and just kind of like show you guys what he knows so far. It's nothing crazy. I mean, he's just a baby. He is a little distracted. <laughs> let's see. Charlie! Are you interested? Okay, here. Oh, you know, you know what I'm gonna ask you to do. Charlie, sit. Yes, that's good. Look at this, this one's pretty cool. Hey, Charlie, sit. Down. Yes, look at that. I'm trying to teach him shake a paw too, um, but I feel like that's gonna take a little more work. He totally, he doesn't totally understand it yet. We know sit and we know down, and that's a start, right? <laughs> Andre's watching him for a second. I came upstairs to get changed because I'm still in my pajamas. Also, I want to show you guys. I, I basically haven't really changed out of my pajamas, like, I mean, unless we need to run out and do something, but when I'm around him, I've been wearing, you know, sweatpants, pajama shirts, because, do you guys see my sweatpants? Do you see my sweatpants? There are holes, look how many. There's holes in, like, pretty much all of my clothes. He, he tore a hole in this shirt as well. It's in a spot that I'm not gonna show you. Um, yeah, he's teething, so he's chewing everything. <laughs> Crazy. My hands have so many like little scratches on them. There's like puncture wounds on my fingers. Um, those have healed a bit. Those were from a few days ago. Yeah, I've got to make sure that, you know, I'm not wearing any clothes that I really care about around him because they're probably going to end up with little baby holes in them. So I'm going to get changed um, because I'm actually going to head out for a little bit. Hopefully Andre will be okay um, without me. <sighs> it's like having a child. It's like having a baby, I swear. <laughs> I'm like on the floor in the bathroom. So yeah, I'm getting ready. I'm just gonna put some sunscreen on because I'm gonna be outside and it's sunny. We just wanna, we wanna protect our face. So we'll put that on and then we will be ready to go. Does that look rubbed in? I think so. Wonderful. <laughs> this is the fit, I know. Wow, oh my gosh, crazy. Who would have thought that I could come up with something so unique? I found Andre's outside. Are you training him? Yeah. Is he being good? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm not really trying to make him do anything specific. He just to, uh, being a good boy. Really shows some really good behavior. <laughs> You're being so good. Yeah, we've like Googled different types of training. This is the one that's called free shaping, right? Yeah, so whenever he shows any behavior and he makes a good choice on his own, I'll yeah. give him a treat. So I'm trying okay. to make him look at me. Yes. Because the more he can look at me, the more attention he, he can give me, then the less Better. he'll be distracted. Yeah. Especially with more stressful situations, so. You're doing great, honey. He's like, where is more treat? So it is almost noon now. I feel like it's not, you know, it doesn't really count as the morning anymore. So that was the morning routine with puppy. Very different than our morning routine with no puppy. Main difference is less sleep, puppy, puppy. You guys get the gist. I might introduce him to the cats today. If you want to see that as a vlog, let me know, okay? Yeah, it, it'll be interesting. It will definitely be interesting. Um, and if you guys want to see any other specific videos, leave them in the comments and let me know if you think, if, if, if you've noticed that he's grown because you guys haven't seen him in like a week. So, and yeah, other than that, I hope you enjoyed the morning routine. Um, and I hope you're having a lovely week so far. And I will see. Okay, Charlie has something to say. Bye. I will see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>